Hello, my name's Catherine Knight and I'm a children's allergy nurse. I'm going to talk to you today about how to recognise anaphylaxis and when to administer your adrenaline auto-injector device. Regardless of the type of adrenaline auto-injector you or your child have been prescribed, the symptoms of anaphylaxis and the indications for using the adrenaline remain the same. Anaphylaxis is a severe life-threatening reaction and is recognised by problems with the airway, breathing or consciousness level. Regarding the airway, you or your child may have difficulty in talking or swallowing or have a hoarse voice. Regarding breathing, there may be um, wheezing coming from the lower chest area as well as um, coughing and um, difficulty, general difficulty in breathing. Regarding consciousness, you or your child may feel faint or actually faint due to um, blood, a drop in blood pressure. Anaphylaxis is a life-threatening emergency and adrenaline needs to be given promptly and repeated as necessary. I'll now show you the three different devices we currently use in the UK and demonstrate how to use them. Each adrenaline device comes with one dose of adrenaline and can be used only once. To use the EpiPen device, ensure you're holding it in the right way, blue to the sky, orange to the thigh. Remove the safety cap and swing into the upper outer thigh from 10 centimetres away until you hear a click. Once in place, hold for 10 seconds and then remove rub the area. Any adrenaline device can be administered through one layer of clothing. EpiPen have recently said that um, it can remain in situ for three seconds only um, and, and the dose will be effective. The second device I will demonstrate to you is the Jext pen. Jext is similar to EpiPen in it has a safety cap to remove at the top but can be placed onto the thigh, pushed and again held in place for 10 seconds. The Emirate device is the newest um, adrenaline auto-injector we have in the UK and is slightly different to both Jext and EpiPen. Hold in your hand, remove the safety cap, press against the thigh and the manufacturers recommend to hold in situ for 5 seconds. Once adrenaline has been administered, it's vital that you or your child remain sitting down or lying down. Do not get up and move around, walk or run, and ensure that an ambulance has been called. 